the most prestigious club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this, the final itself. Who will prevail? It's PSG, they face Arsenal, live right here on EA TV. Well, there's nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crowd. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined as always on these big occasions by Stuart Robson. It's Paris Saint-Germain, and they take on Arsenal. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. And here's how the lineup looks for PSG. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Vitor Ferreira starts alongside Fabian in central midfield. And lining up through the middle in attack today is Kylian Mbappe. And PSG pushing forward with options available. Hakimi. And here's Dembele. Must take the lead here. He's done it. What a moment. The opening goal in this Champions League final. And just look at the celebrations. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. So the game restarted by Arsenal. A wake-up call for the Arsenal players, perhaps. Can they construct a response? Gabriel Thomas Partey Rice with it Tomiyasu and here's Saliba Gabriel Partey it's with Gabriel William Saliba Kai Havertz Declan Rice Thomas Partey Physically strong and secure on the ball Rice Could play it in Over the touchline for what will be an Arsenal throw Terrific defending to stop them progressing. Ferreira. Now PSG moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Oh, managing to beat him. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. He might yet finish. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way, surely. Well, here it is again, and the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger, and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Gabriel it's with Takahiro Tomiyasu Farce an encouraging Arsenal move Farce using his physical strength to shield it Martin Odegaard Opportunity for them to get back into the game. High pressing and good high pressing. Magnificent challenge to win it back.
Fabian. Oh, big opportunity. Oh, it's a terrific challenge. Havertz. It's with Erdogan. Can they produce something? Spot on with that tackle. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Dembele. Well, there we have it. We're at the halfway mark now here at Wembley. So back in business here and PSG dominating the proceedings in the first half. Will we see a similar pattern in the second 45? And Kai Havertz. And back with Havertz. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. And a throw in for Arsenal. Gabriel Martin Odegaard and here's Saliba Declan Rice Thomas Partey Rice with it well they keep passing away well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. Substitution time it is here. And deep into the penalty area. Well, he almost nodded that one in. Martin Odegaard, Partey. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Martinelli, big chance! And there is the goal! Wow, that changes the equation! And they have the momentum now! Well, here's the replay. What a pass this is from Saka. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Well, you can see the frustration in his face. His team have just switched off here. So back at action, and Arsenal just one behind now. Hakimi. Ferreira. Nuno Mendes. A very good tackle. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. I'll dealt with that ball comfortably. Partey. On to Trossard. 
Well, that's how to shield the ball and control it. Oh, that's a really good run. And struggling to get the shot off. Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive. Well, let's take another look, and it's not good enough defensively. They're slow to react, don't get tight enough, and don't deal with the situation. And there's the outcome. So the ball is running again at 2 all. Nuno Mensch. Throw in here for Arsenal. So making the substitution now. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Vitor Ferreira. PSG looking dangerous. Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. White. And here's Saliba. Martin Odegaard. Bukayo Saka. Arsenal remain on the front foot. Can they find a winning goal? Really getting stuck in. Thomas Partey. 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 Rice. Still trying to make something happen. Fabian. Here's Marquinhos. Hakimi. And we are going to have two additional minutes. Skriniar. Here's Fabian. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up. So back in business here, the first period of extra time and it might well come down to mental fortitude. Who wants this more? Martinelli Rice now just the tackle that was needed well maybe a good position from which to counter they need to get bodies back decides to shoot oh he couldn't outwit the keeper Fired over by Usman Dembele. No nonsense piece of defending. Well, the fans want to see a shot. And a textbook interception. Chance maybe to use their counter attacking ability to good effect. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Jorginho and still looking for space and the first period of extra time comes to an end still level here
And away they go again. Second period of extra time has commenced. Gabriel Jesus. It's with Takahiro Tomiyasu. Jorginho. Tomiyasu. And with the teams locked together, Arsenal chasing and chasing that winner. Not well, a bit of an unforced error, and it's going to be a throw. Gabriel Jesus Rice Oh big opportunity And keeping it out A perfectly taken corner Could make all the difference in this game This one for Arsenal favoured a short one here Jorginho can he put them in front no is the answer to the question and that could be so important at this stage well will they get another chance that would surely have won the game for them So the corner played into the box and the keeper takes the ball but the main thing is he held on to it Nuremberg and we will have just one additional minute and it has all come down to this in the Champions League final a shootout to determine the winners And so the penalty shootout about to commence. And as a player, and that is when you need your goalkeeper. Well, he fired it straight down the middle. Well, it's all about keeping a cool head. So lethal in front of goal. And confidently converted. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. And there it is, perfectly executed. And he's beaten the keeper. Can he convert? And the penalty converted down the middle. And he finds the net, he could hardly miss. Almost intolerable pressure. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And now a heaven-sent opportunity to win the match. And there it is! That brings it to a conclusion and a contrast in emotions. One team joyful, the other absolutely devastated. Well, what drama, what scenes, and what a good finish to this game. It really has been exhilarating. Well, in football, you don't forget these moments in a hurry. Due reward for their persistence and their overall excellence. Well, it really has been engrossing today. Such a tight game, but you have to feel sorry for the losers. They were so close, but yet so far away. And the party mood has enveloped the stadium. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. 
It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. Arsenal, the winners of the UEFA Champions League. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. Well, the celebrations are ongoing. I don't think they're going to be brought to an end anytime soon as they savour the moment with their supporters. And they've certainly played their part, the fans. They deserve to be involved with these celebrations. They've made so much noise here. And now for the photographs that will surely stand the test of time. And what a great achievement for this club. And these are photos that are going to be cherished for a long time to come.